Now, the opposition members of parliament boycotting parliamentary sittings is still a very big topic in the media right here in Uganda and uh, they are still very adamant on attending parliamentary sittings until government comes out to explain the whereabouts of uh, the missing people and the human rights violations in Uganda. Now, the Speaker of Parliament, Right Honorable Anita Mong, yesterday announced more action against the opposition members of Parliament. Well, Anita Monk, during plenary yesterday, directed that members of Parliament who have chosen to continue with the boycott shall not participate in the forthcoming East African Community Interparliamentary Games slated for 7th to 18th December this year in Chigali, Rwanda. Nobody who is out of the house should be allowed to travel because you are not in the house, you are not part of the house, you've decided to be out of the house so you don't enjoy your right. Uh, she also ordered the clerk to parliament not to allow them to attend parliamentary committees. They should also not be in the committees because a committee is an extension of the house. Well, Among also told of opposition members of parliament attacking her on social media that she's immune to their attacks because the impasse on human rights violations was created by the executive, not the parliament of Uganda. Some friends of ours, our colleagues, come and clog in outside there and go back. That is, it's about integrity. Hmm? I am going to print that list of members who have clogged in stayed out there and pretend to be in the house and I will publish it in the newspapers. Yes, so that is uh, the latest update from the Parliament of Uganda. Uh, the Speaker of Parliament, Anita Mong, is saying Musaga, Mujakuda, and the opposition members of Parliament are saying Nedanyabo, Tetuja, we are not coming back until the issues we fronted on the floor of Parliament are sorted. Yes, so basically, uh, that is the situation right now in the Parliament of Uganda. But as usual, I get a few comments on social media and uh, we see what other Ugandans are saying that side. Let me start off with uh, Lugala Moses. Uh, thank you. Our speaker cannot continue to accept any indiscipline anymore. Okay. Well, Chisa Simon, address their demands before intimidating them, please. Okay. Well, this is uh, Okapesi Joseph. So, what of their reasons of boycotting parliament? Are you done with it or you think that you are above the law? Okay, let me wind up with Ellie. I wish the pressure Anita Monk is, you know, putting on opposition members of parliament was shifted to the ministers responsible to account for the missing Ugandans. Well, there you go. Opinions of some Ugandans on social media. You can also put your comment in the comment section on this story. And uh, don't forget to subscribe in case you haven't. And also tap on the bell for all the notifications. Uh, but also follow me on TikTok, Amelad Zmilo, aka Fula. It is a bye for now. Thank you. <music>